Hi, everyone. Cannot believe today we are celebrating five years of the Fox G1 Research Foundation. I've been doing a lot of reflecting on where we've been, where we are, where we're going, and three words come to mind for me. Purpose, progress, and ambition. So let me first start with purpose. Five years ago, I was on an airplane, a scientific plan in my pocket, meeting a group of parents full of hope that we could change the trajectory of our children's disease. Together, we started the Fox G1 Research Foundation and sped ahead on our purpose. And where does this purpose come from? For us, it's obviously our children. Our Fox G1 children fill us with joy. And if any of you have met a Fox G1 child, you know that their laughter is contagious. They live in the moment, they're very innocent, but that they also suffer quite a bit. Most of our children um, suffer from seizures, dystonia, scoliosis, other organ failures. Many are in the hospital for large lengthy periods of time. And over the, the past several years, a few of the children that we have known, that we have loved have passed away. And all of this fuels our purpose because we know that there is a better outcome for our children. We know that there are breakthrough therapies out there to give our children the life that they deserve. And that is what drives us. And that gets me to my second word, which is progress. I am very proud of our foundation for what we have accomplished in the last five years. From going from knowing basically nothing about this gene, we have number one, understood the gene function. Number two, we have identified targets in the gene that we can approach for different therapies. Number three, we have actually initiated gene therapy experiments and seen very promising breakthrough results. Number four, we've located a group of small molecules and we're continuing to do so to alleviate symptoms. We have organized our community and understood our disease faster than almost any other rare disease community on the planet. All of this has led us to be known as innovators in the space and move this disease along. Most excitedly, Last week, we heard that we've finally been approved for our first clinical trial for FOXG1 syndrome that is taking place at NYU. This drug that's been created by Zogenix, now UCB Pharma, is specifically for our most severe children, the ones that are not responding well to current seizure medications. This is a huge milestone for our foundation to accomplish this in five years, and I could not be more thankful. And that brings me to the third word, which is ambition. For me, everything that we have done over the last five years positions us now to completely unleash our greatest ambitions. I believe over the next several years, we are going to see not one, but a multitude of gene therapy clinical trials for Fox G1 syndrome. I believe we're going to see a multitude of drug trials for our condition. I believe that our breakthroughs will not only help Fox G1 syndrome, but the greater scientific community of autism, schizophrenia, and Alzheimer's. And none of this would be possible without the community. We have done this together. It takes a village, it takes a community to cure a rare disease. Our donors, we would be nowhere without you. Our parents who tirelessly fundraise, volunteer, all on top of caring for a rare disease child. And our friends and family, you cheer us on through the good times and you lift us up when we are down, when the challenge seems too great. We would be nowhere without you. Thank you all and happy birthday to the Fox G1 Research Foundation.